Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Soraya, and today I wanna to talk about what to do if something is preventing you from being with your twin flame. Circumstances beyond your control, family situations, challenges um, in life, you know, financial challenges maybe even, maybe there's like long distance, maybe there's cultural barriers, language barriers, um, there could be any number of things that it could feel like is preventing you from being with your twin flame. So what about in those cases? How, how, how do you go about it then? Um, well, there's a reason why this is coming up in your reality. So everything that we feel some feelings about, <laughs> um, that's, you know, basically being triggered by something outside of us. It's, it's basically that that feeling on the inside of us is manifesting that experience. And sometimes we have particular lessons that we want to learn in our lives, spiritually, in general, and in our twin flame unions. And sometimes those lessons have to do with healing, uh, feeling powerless, feeling stuck, feeling prevented, feeling limited. Um, feeling unsafe, feeling unsure, feeling, you know, this instability. All of these things are the types of upsets that can come up in a situation like this. And for you, you know, it's just a matter of what you're going through, which of course I can help you with in a, in a coaching session if you want one-on-one -on -one support, seeing what's specifically going on on your journey. But these are the types of upsets that a lot of times can come up. A variety of different things can come up having to do with these issues of having something manifest that seems to prevent you from being with your twin flame. But the truth is nothing prevents you from being with your twin flame because nothing prevents you from being with yourself. You have all the power. So you are able to heal separation within and then that gets reflected on the outside. Instead of having challenges and things preventing you manifesting on the outside, you actually experience that oneness on the outside, you know, reflected back to you because you feel that oneness within. Nothing can give that to you and nothing can take that away. That is yours because this is your relationship with yourself. With a soulmate, we're so conditioned to see it as like, these are two separate people and you have to make it work. Twin flames, it's you and yourself. So you have complete access to yourself to be able to develop any kind of relationship with yourself that you want. And these feelings of feeling powerless, feeling stuck, feeling you know, limited, feeling trapped in a bad situation, feeling separate from your twin flame and feeling like there's nothing you can do to stop it. These feelings are feelings that you can resolve 100% within you without even having to talk to your twin flame, without having to even resolve that issue on the outside. You don't have to control, you don't have to change anything. You have the power to be able to change that on the inside. And so this work is all about claiming your power back so that you can change your life from the inside out instead of trying to change it from the outside in, which never really works. Um, this is how you approach it from an empowered stance, and that is that you love yourself where you're hurting, where you're upset, and work through what arises. It's okay that you're experiencing this challenge. It isn't forever, um, but yeah, it, it can be healed. It's just a matter of working through what it brings up for you with the mirror exercise and realizing the truth that nothing can ever separate you from your twin flame. Just like no, no one can separate me from myself. No one can separate you from yourself. No one can like get in between me and my own self and say, you cannot have access to you. That's not possible. In the same way, no one can prevent you from being with yourself. And so therefore no one and nothing can prevent you from being with your twin flame. That's an outside reflection of your inner world. You have the power to cultivate the kind of relationship that you want on the inside, one where you're free to be together and where you feel that power and that full awareness and you believe in the truth that you have complete access to yourself. When you act on that and you're living with yourself within and you're staying and you're being faithful and loyal to yourself and you've cultivated that kind of relationship with yourself, it gets reflected on the outside. So no worries. It doesn't matter if you've got an ocean between you, if it seems like the whole world is against you guys being together. It doesn't matter. You don't even have to resolve that problem. You just go within and claim your power and, you know, do the work Jeff and Shelley teach. That is about claiming your power. And uh, you'll see all of that change. If you need help with this, of course, I'm always here. I love to help people with these things. I've gone through my fair share of challenges around this, of feeling like there were all these things preventing me from being with my twin flame. And I, I, I know from experience, personally and professionally, this can absolutely be resolved. So no worries, you're not stuck. If you want any support, you can claim that beneath this video. My website is there. 
and um, all of Jeff and Shelley's resources are down beneath this video as well if you want, you know, the teaching to learn about Twin Flames and how they work and the support that you need. So, uh, yeah. If there's anything else I can help you guys with, if you guys have questions of things that you would like me to talk about in these videos, definitely comment beneath my videos. I'll try to get to them, you know, when I can. I, I, I tend to, like, I have like a list that I work off of, and so I'll incorporate it in if I know that that's something that you guys want to hear about. Um, but yeah, I'm here to help, and you're not powerless, you're not stuck, I promise, and um, it can be resolved. And, it, you know, Jesus said, my background is in Christianity. Jesus said that, uh, let it be done unto you as you believe. And when we believe that there's always going to be something preventing us from our good, that there's always going to be some challenge, that life has to be a struggle, that we can't just have what we want. We can't just be with our ultimate lover. Like it can't be that easy. When we believe these things, this, this is what we manifest. And, um, it doesn't have to be that way. There's a, there's another side to that coin where you can experience a very different kind of reality. So you have the power here. And so, yeah, like I said, I'd be happy to help you with this. Um, reach out. My website, everything is beneath this video. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you found it helpful, uh, please do subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next one.